everybody and welcome back to another cooking with christian due to a popular demand so today i'm going to be cooking a cake nice super moist french vanilla now it's going to be topped with good old chocolate nice milky and creamy and then right here is going to be the delicious inside of the double layer french vanilla chocolate cake it's going to be intense so first ingredients simple one cup of water half a cup of vegetable oil, three eggs, a beater, butter to boop, boop, and then we are gonna get this bad boy in the oven, so let's prep this up. So I have two mixing bowls, so I work a little quicker, so ah, oh no, oh God, no, I thought something happened, oh, so sanitary, oh, there, yep. And I have the nice little fan on, so it kinda cools off the living room and the kitchen. Um, there's my dog, Euchers. Anyways, okay, let's get back to it. Uh, butter. Yeah. This is so much harder with one hand. Like, you guys don't even know. It's crazy. So I'm just having the butter here to prep. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay, that's actually better. Now that's a little warmer. Good thing I took a while to prep this. All right. <laughs> Good job, butter. Thanks. All right, and then we're going to get the eggs. This is going to be the hard part. So we're gonna be stirring this bad boy right now. So move that, move this, get the other two eggs right there. Move it. This is the hard part. <gasps> okay, let's try again. Oh wow, I'm full. Okay, that was amazing. All right, two. Oh, oh. Ugh. All right, I need to make sure there's no eggshells. There are no eggshells, because look at those shells. Huzzah. I need one more, I'm gonna still have this other batch. So since I'm doing two packets, I'm doing, you know, that's a double layer. All righty, and <laughs> honestly, I'm just compressing it. I seen that shell, I seen that shell. It's somewhere here, It's it's gone forever. Someone is going to be very unpleasant if they eat this. Anyways, uh, either it was a shell or it just perfectly went in. But anyways, let's get this. So water. And this is the vegetable oil. What? Oh man, so I need to remember that. Vegetable, water, green. Okay, now we're going to stir it. It's in about two minutes, so I'm going to stir this. Yeah, come on. Yeah, what inspired me of wanting to actually cook this delicious double, like, you know, double-sided, what the hell would it be called? Is it double-sided egg? Or double-sided egg? Uh, Double-layered cake. As I was watching a lot of cake uh, war yesterday, pretty intense. And, I, and one of my buddies really enjoys watching the cooking with Christian, so might as well bring both things back. Plus, I haven't uploaded a video in forever, so there's that. <laughs> <laughs> and we are back. I just did a quick cut just so I'm like, you know, constant. Because this says this is on the phone. I'm just like pausing it, you know, when I can. But yeah, I'm still whipping this bad boy into shape. And I want to put them in at the same time. But yeah, I'm still doing it all with one hand. Don't worry. And if I can cook this amazing thing with one hand, then that means you guys can do it too. And I hope you guys really don't mind that fan. I wanted to put that fan because of to block the TV noise and stuff. Yeah, I should have turned off the TV, but you know what? It's too late now. We're too deep in here. And plus, it's nice little white noise. Just in case I don't make any, you got something else to keep you company. Unless you want my dog singing to you. Flat face, come over here. Flat face, papa. Come here. Look at him, look at him. Flat face, oh, that's not flat face, that's smoky. So yeah, unless you want puppies to sing to you, then yeah. I don't know how long it's been. Also, the reason I did cut it, because I'm, I'm a smart guy. So I'm over here thinking, maybe if I cut it, and then, you know, exactly record this for two minutes, then I'll be good. So that's actually my secondary reasoning to this. So I got my own little timer. Oh, and by the way, yes, I'm left-handed. Yeah, <laughs> at all. It's getting nice and thick. I need to make sure there's no powder. I want to try to, you know, do this best way I can. 
We got about 30 or so more seconds. And then after I'm gonna do, this is the first cut tool. But once it hits two minutes, I'm gonna butter that pan. I'm gonna put it in that one. Or right, just in case you guys are wondering what brand it is, I'll pull them all up right now. With the magic of, well, I'm not gonna cut it. It's too, it's too advanced for me. But I will, you know, bring the stuff up. Except for the eggs, I don't think eggs really matter unless you get like those thick ass, big, nice ones. Anyways, okay, so that's done. That's two minutes of constant beating. So we're gonna, we don't wanna make too much of a mess. Look at that. I, see, over here cooking with Christian, we're next and clean, except for that. Anyways, this is what I'm using, the super moist French vanilla from Betty Crocker. The lights, ooh, just putting in a mix. Anyways, toss. Same brand, Betty Crocker. We're using the cream cheese, rich and cream frosting. See, now there was whipped. I believe this is whipped. Yeah, this is whipped frosting, milk chocolate. Because I want to add a little bit. This is going to be the top layer. This is going to be the gooey inside. I'm going to pack this bad boy. It's going to be delicious. All right, so. Let's do that. Get some of that butter in here. This is going to be a little sticky bottom, so. And I think I should get the sides. I don't know. I didn't see those, you know, amazing professional chefs do the sides, but I'm gonna do it, even though it's hard with one friggin' hand. Anyways, all right, so we got our mix. Let's get it in. Mmm, that looks okay, guys. That's satisfying. Look at that. Hooey. That is beautiful. Look at that batter. Look at my reflection, it's like shadow. Dark now. And then we still got the other little guy, so we'll use that one for round two. I need to get another egg. So, uh, super cut. I totally forgot to prep the oven, hold on. I think they said from, there it is. Heat oven for the, for dark pan. So this is a light pan, light shiny. So we're gonna go ahead and do it for 350. Pop, 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 pop. The bonus. I'm gonna clean that up really quick. Eh. Eh. Yeah. Remember, guys, always keep your area clean because you don't want to clean it after you're done. Because you're gonna be like, oh, I just want to eat this delicious cake and or whatever else I cook. Oh, that's gross. But yeah. Um, oh my god. When so when I first did that, Jesus. Oh man, I smacked it and I was like, okay, we got this. I just. I'm like, why is this shell emptier than I, it, would, it should be? And then it just, just plopped. Honestly, wish I didn't have the white noise so you guys could actually hear it. Okay, round two is upon us. That guy's still there, so whoop. Same gimmick, let's go. There it is, see, now we got this. Look at that, that is full round. Let's see if I get super good luck. That's ready. And come on, yoke. Yes! Let's see if we get three. Three, three, come on. See, I'm getting better just using one hand. Oh. All three. Oh, wait. Oh, no. One of them bled. Oh. My look. All right. Water. Vegetable oil. Check. So I gotta clean those bad boys. Pachita, on that. Oh, that's yoked up bowl up earlier. Yeah, I hope that's in the bowl. See guys, this is how you prep your stuff for cleaning. So you don't have to worry about it later. Alrighty. Uh, where's that beater? Alright. Got about a minute. So three minutes of this, and then we're good. But you guys don't have to see all this, because y'all already seen that with that guy. So, oh, she my time. Anyways. That's how you clean it. We're gonna finish this bad boy up. Oh, I almost missed. I was about to pour this all over the counter. Alrighty, we get to watch this slowly go in. <laughs> a little quicker, my hand's getting a little tired. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Ah. Ouch. <laughs> 
All right, come on, a little quicker. <laughs> yeah, you got of heavy. You're, you're still big, you're big mass. <laughs> a little, little wrist. <laughs> wow, that's pretty big. <laughs> wow. Oh no. Oh wow. <laughs> this is heavy. One hand, man. One hand. Ah, man. I just, I really need you to. I just, I just really need you to all go in there right now. Like, I was still all right there. Let me. Oh no. <laughs> Improv. Oh, this is the worst. This is a bad idea. But we're gonna try to get as much as possible because I know I did it with that guy when the cameras were off. I used another hand. <gasps> no, no, me? Yes, yes, I did. I actually did. I'm so sorry, guys. I used a second hand just to be scraping that out, just so I got the maximum amount of do. Okay, that that's enough. That's 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 all we actually needed. I just wanted that one little draw. All right, so let's do this. Huh. Ooh, that hit me in the face. Alrighty, actually, I don't even know how long this is supposed to be in there. Let's check, shall we? Huh. Uh, what is this? Make sure oil large bowl for at least two minutes. Got that. Cool for ten. Well, what the hell's the baking time? Oh, twenty-eight. Right here. Pan bake time in minutes. Twenty-eight to thirty-three. So we're gonna put it to twenty-eight minutes. Let's get to it. See you in a bit for the toothpick test. All right, so we're gonna pluck one of these guys out. Put a cook. Oh, look at that. Oh, little fatty. All right, so toothpick. If it comes out clean, that is clean. Okay, good. I wait. Mm, it's a little doughy. It's a little doughy. And you look, you can see it jiggle. Ooh, bochi, 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 bochi. Anyways, um, I might leave it in for a bit. This guy's a little fluff too. Let me check this guy. Because he looks a little more cooked than the other one. I don't know why. Butchie. Up. Hmm. Nah, dough's still coming out. Alright. Probably pop these guys in for the 33 minutes. So, 28. Okay, got it. Alright, I'll be back. Who is upon us? Alright, let's bring this bad boy in. Toothpick. Kawaii. All right, and oh, oh, that is smooth. A little bit of dough though, so has to go back in. We don't want a raw cake. All right, uh, hmm, it's got like a nice golden look, so I'm gonna give it like three more minutes. Round three. A little more solid. They're kind of falling in. I'm pull both of them out because they should have already exceeded the time where they need to be in there. See, this guy's already browning up. Looks nice though. Doesn't look bad. Let's close this in to keep the heat just in case I'm gonna pop them back in. All right, so let's pop this guy out. And you. Ooh, this one's ready. This guy's ready. This one looks a little fresh still. Ooh, ooh, is that, I might be ready. Oh, I'm gonna pop this guy in for like about a minute. I'm gonna put him on the right too because that's where this one was. So, just one minute, one minute. Oh man, this one looks good now, look at that. Twins. Now I'm just gonna put the butt. Yup, there it is. Okay now, 10 minutes. And then I get to frost it up. Right, it has been the full 10 minutes. Now we get butter knife. I mean, these shouldn't honestly just slide right off, but I'm gonna be super safe about it. So we're gonna just go around with butter knife. I'm gonna trust that, um, that that butter bottom I gave it was enough for it to be all nice and shake. All right, first one. This one is honestly smooth as cake. All right, we got a little bit of resistance. Nice little golden brown color here. Oh, oh no. 
I actually, oh no, I'm, I'm actually stabbing it. Oh, that's terrible. Well, I ruined the cake. Oh my god, that is stupid hot. Oh my god. A plate. This is gonna be stupid difficult. One breaking hand. Okay. Uh, let's look for a nice flatula. I know this is probably the worst thing because I'm just gonna. Chule. That's difficult. Screw it. Ah. That is one. You. Yep. I knew that would happen. Alright. So, seeing as that's that little cut, we might put this one up now. Because look at that. Oh no, because then I need it. But, okay, so I'm going to leave it right here. And we'll let it cool off. And let's get to decorating. Okay. One hand, butter knife. We're gonna be using this in the, as the middle base. And I'm gonna just do first the center, and then I'm gonna get that guy on here, then I'll do all the chocolate. So, let's get to it. Just lather that on there. I'm actually gonna get a spoon to throw it all in. Ha! And just, yeah. Yeah, all right. And we're gonna get that center nice. Oh, look at that. This is gonna be a little big boy. Alrighty, look at that. Mm, mm, mm. I seen the, <laughs> the chefs use a butter knife, and I'm like, you know what? I can do that too. Now, this is a long adventure. I'm not gonna lie. I got multiple things to throw this at. I gotta throw this on my story on Snap, and then obviously my YouTube channel. I can't wait, this is gonna be great. Oh, dude, this is so much icing. But you know what? Like a lot of people, I'm gonna make my cake and eat it. Well, I mean, not all of it, you know, but you know. I'm still gonna have a nice slice of this. Look at that. And this is all with one hand, guys. So if I can do this, you can do it too. I'm gonna find out how to do this with just my mind one day. And then you guys will be able to do it too. Look at that. I bet you there's like bakers in here like, oh my lord, what is he doing? I honestly put too much. This is too much icing. And this is like the center. So I'm not even sure if this is even right. I should be using this in the centerpiece. But you know what? I didn't I didn't make a nice I wasn't gonna just put jelly and just I mean I could have, it would have been interesting, but this looks nice. Alright, I think it's all nice and spread, so we're gonna just slap the other one on there. Yup. One hand on him. Oh, look at that. <laughs> I'm gross. Looks really good though. The bread by itself, this side of the cake tasted amazing. I wish you guys would try this. All right. Now that that's all settled in. Oh, look at it. Oh, it's all gross. Time to get the chocolate on. One hand. Dude, this is going to be such a long video because I'm going to be throwing all the cuts in together. Like, just everything. I'm just throwing it all in and just throwing it at the internet. So this is going to be a wonderful mess. Oh, we need to replace this. Huh. <laughs> okay. Oh, man. So this one's a little different. So I'm gonna probably do a little bit of cutting and whatnot to get this bad boy all nice and pretty full. Look at that. Mm -hmm. It's like it was made for this. 
We're gonna try to do a thinner layer for this. The chocolate. Actually. Oh boy she smells amazing. So I'm just gonna keep getting this little guy on. I'll be no, no, actually no. I'm gonna do this entire cake with one hand. I think that was like pretty much the goal. It just looks like a giant macaron. I need a spoon. Oh. <laughs> spoon. I need spoon for more chocolate. Oh. Okay. Oh, this is such a monster. Like all the bakers out there that are watching this are probably like, yeah, maybe not. You're starting in all the wrong areas. <laughs> I honestly feel like I'm doing it wrong, but you know, this is a learning process. Look at the sizes. <laughs> this one's thicker than that one. Butternut. Look at that. Mm -mm -mm. I gotta hide that. Bonita. Then after it's done, I'm gonna let it sit for like about a, like five minutes or so. Then I'll cut into it. I'll show you guys a big cut. I can't wait. Honestly, I'm glad whoever is like sticking here this long because this is a process. Like, I wish I could like have this just attached to my actual face so you guys could see what it, exactly what I'm looking at. This is <laughs> this is crazy. One hand icing the cake. Oh, oh look at that. Oh, that's all sweet. It's like doo doo. Oh, gross. <laughs> this is so good. Look at this. Look at this craftsmanship. Look at that olive oil right there. Mmm. Oh, look at that. Oh, it doesn't even look decorated. Oh, oh, no. It looks like a guy with, using one hand did this. Oh, he puts it on his YouTube channel. Oh, gross. All right, let's see. There we go. <laughs> this is great. This is probably my best video off the bat. <laughs> this is the best video, guys. You guys gotta share this. I need shares, likes, subscribes, and everything so you guys can see my masterpieces. This is what I cook while it's using one hand. And there's a, oh no. Oh, look at that. Oh, I gotta hide that. Oh, no one's gotta see that. Oh, what's that white stuff? Oh, that's gross. <laughs> My poor cake. I'm like mocking it while I, while I ice them. Honestly, the part that I don't want to touch at all is like that. <laughs> I should just leave that. No one will ever see it. I don't know how people do it. Like they like do like that clean sweep. Maybe they like go like this, like this, like this, like that. Make it look nice and smooth. All right, let's get. Oh, let's get the nasty side. Oh, no one wants to see that side. This that's the side we're all just be cutting from. No one else will ever see it. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's like the guy cut it on accident while he was recording. Oh, that's gross. Look at that. Oh, this is, this is the part that, this is the big bucks right here. Oh, no one wants to see that. That's the backside of the cake. <laughs> a cake isn't supposed to have a backside, but I managed to create one. Oh, look at it. Oh. It looks like someone dug into it already. Even though it was just a miscut. Yes, I'm using my other finger to just stabilize it while I take the icing. Man, I have no clue what you guys are seeing because I have this on my right hand while I'm, you know, doing everything else with my left. So this is a monster. It looks like a monster and I like that. It's got its own uniqueness to it. It's gonna taste amazing. That's kind of what matters is the taste. Presentation, probably like a solid nine. Taste is like 10, just top 10. Yeah, this is a high quality design. I don't know, I could see this being out there at Walmart or Target. But uh, yeah, this is some um, high quality icing.
We're gonna go around like this right here. Once all of it's like covered, I'm gonna just say that's it because it looks like it's all covered up. Ugh, what's that? Alrighty, I think that's good. Look at my, my cake. <laughs> no, no, I'm not. I was gonna say if I messed up again and it was a still gooey, I was gonna just. Mm, damn. That would have been too much work lost, but. Whew, I was so tempted to just, like you know, order. But yeah, and this is the cake you can create with one hand. So, you know, forget waiting. I think I waited long enough. We're gonna cut into this bad boy. Happy birthday to me, I guess. It's not my birthday. I just wanted to make this, just because of Cake Wars. You want a knife? Crooked knife. Fuck. <laughs> that was a big. Wow. I'm gonna show you guys some skill. Look at this. Oh, oh God. Mmm, 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 mmm. That is a beautiful cake. Now, for the taste test. This has been a while. Alrighty. Is this just a top? Oh, man. Now with the center. Center. Mmm. <laughs> that is good. That is good. So guys, this is a success. Maybe the appearance could have been a little better to at least be 10 on 10, but taste, phenomenal. Amazing. Best cake I've ever had. Well, yeah, thanks for joining me on my first cake I ever baked all alone, completely, and with one hand. Everything was recorded, so. This is amazing. Oh my God, I need milk. This is, I should have put, I should put peanut butter on this. Oh man, oh my God. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like, subscribe, share this to understand how Christian cooks. Oh. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one.